Those parts should do the trick. Okay, the buggy will be ready soon, but there are a couple things you have to know before you take that thing out for a ride. Remember, the wasteland is a dangerous place. Give me a call if you ever smash your vehicle up and can't drive it. I'll give you a lift back here. And also, if you need any repairs, just drive back to the garage and I'll fix her up. Okay, let me get these parts installed and you'll be all set. Go ahead and grab that radio on the counter there. You're ready to go. Take it out for a spin, but remember, call me if you need a tow. How do you like that buggy? It isn't much now, but you put some guns on it and you'll be able to go up against just about anything. Now, you ready for some more work? Some bandits have taken control of the checkpoint at the canyon entrance, trying to cut us off from the big town to the east. And we can't let that happen. I need you to use your... Special talents for a demolition job. You think you can do this for me? I'll even let you use my trusty sniper rifle for the job. Excellent. Here are some explosive charges. Just place them on the gate and run. Good luck. Carefully.
put together my own little time trial race. You want to give it a go? Nothing too challenging. It's just a little course that I race on. Tell you what, beat my time, friend, and I'll give you a nice little boost upgrade for your buggy. You want to give it a shot? Good luck. I'm impressed. You are, as we say, a natural behind the wheel. And wait till you feel the boost kick in on that old buggy. Remember, if you need your vehicles repaired, just pull them into the bay and I'll see what I can do. You know, you being here has made this area a lot safer for me and my family. We are in your debt. So now that we can travel safely, it looks like our time together may be coming to an end. I'd like to keep you here. A guy like you is valuable in a place like this. But you're just gonna attract too much attention, and that'll bring in the authority. But there is one more thing I need you to do. Mayor Clayton runs the town of Wellspring to the east. And I've got to get a message to him. And you, you're the only one that can do it. Our supplies are getting low and the mayor's promised help. We need to get restocked before the bandits cut us off again. Can you make the trip? I knew I could count on you. Remember, you ain't got any guns.
Hold up there, stranger. You got business here? You need to see Mayor Clayton. Wait a sec. I'll tell him you're here. Don't you move. Hello, sir. Got a man here to see you. Looks like Dan sent him. Interesting. Send him to me right away. The mayor can see you now, but hold on. We got a few rules here in Wellspring. You see, people don't exactly take the strangers here. Just you keep your head down and mouth shut, and you'll do just fine. Folks here are mighty suspicious. They aren't gonna just trust you, at first. My advice? Best keep to yourself, okay? To get to the mayor's office, just cross the courtyard once you're in town. Can't miss it. If you're looking for Mayor Clayton, he's right over there. If you're looking for a race, go see Jackie Weeks. He's in the back of town. You can't miss him. You knew? I'd like to be one of the first to welcome you to our little town. It's a decent place, and the authority doesn't come around much. You're new here. Stranger, huh? <laughs> yeah, you do look pretty strange. Sure I saw them. Mutants. Ten, twenty of them. All over that valley. Had a hold of someone. That's why you'll never catch me. seen anyone dressed like that in a long time. Welcome to Wellspring, stranger. Best little town this side of what passes for civilization and a few good safe miles from any authority outpost. Nicest people you'll ever find live right here. Friendly folk. Not your wasteland bandit scum. Good honest people. Well, enough with all that. So I hear you have a message from our friend Dan. Let's have it then. Having some trouble with bandits in the settlement again. Dangerous life out there. Deadly even. Well, I can get all this stuff he needs. Gonna take some time though. Not sure how long. He must really respect you to give you this important job. So for now, I'll trust you too. You can stay here in Wellspring while I'll get his supplies, but not dressed like that. You'll bring the authority sniffing around, and I sure don't need that. So, you'll need to lose the arc suit for something a bit more... modern. <laughs> Go see the vendor in town. Get some new clothes. I don't care what you do with that suit, as long as no one sees you in it again. You blend in, understand? Good. Glad we understand each other. When you come back, we can have another little chat.
Didn't the authorities so, say it had stabilized the, the cost of water? About. Some new technology? Nice to meet you. My name is Sally, and this is my place. If you're ever looking for work, come here first. There's always someone looking for something, even me. You get some guns on that thing you're driving, and I'll bet you'll be real useful. Don't forget, get some guns on your buggy, and then come back and Well, if it isn't a stranger from nowhere, care to try your luck at a game of cards? So this here is a simple game of cards. <laughs> it's an easy game to pick up. It can take a lifetime to master. Okay, so here's how we play it. You start with your very own deck of cards. That's right, your deck. And from that deck, you can pick the cards you think will be the best to play. Bit of chance, bit of strategy, but all good fun. No deck? I can sell you a starter deck. Won't be the best damn deck, but at least you'll learn the game and start to figure out that you'll need to find some better cards real quick. Ready to buy that starter deck? <laughs> That's much better. Now you look like any other good, hard-working citizen. But we got another problem. You see, you can't just leave your vehicles parked outside my town. We're civilized here. We have rules. And since it looks like you're gonna be here a while, you're gonna need a place to park your stuff. Go see Mick across the way in the garage. He can help you. After you talk to Mick, Go see Sheriff Black. He should have Dan's supplies all set. Well, well, well. How'd it do to you? And what can Mick do for you? Oh, a garage? Well, you've come to the right place. So here's the deal. Fairest in the wasteland. You let me do all the repairs on your vehicles, and guess what? That covers the rent for the space. What a deal! And I see you got one of them shortwave radios. Mighty handy here, yeah, mighty handy indeed. So if you get into a jam and need a tow, why, just get on the radio and give me a blast. <laughs> How's that for service? That door there will get you into your garage. Or just drive up to the main gate outside and I'll let you in. Couldn't be any easier. Attention and lastly, welcome to town. As you are well aware, there have been Watch it. Hey. Let me guess, you're the stranger that Clayton says is taking some stuff to Dan's place. I'm afraid it isn't gonna happen quite so easily as that. No way I'm sending all these supplies with you in an unarmed buggy. Might as well dump the damn stuff on the road. What you gotta do here is see Rusty by the track entrance. He can get you all set up with some guns, you got it? Get some firepower, then you can come back and take the supplies to Dan. Thing you need to keep your vehicle working right now listen I only take racing certificates for any upgrades or parts you got to win those on the racetrack nothing else so if you want to deal with me you best see Jackie Weeks first he's always on the lookout for new racers 
Hey, my friend. I must say, you do look like a racer if ever I saw one. Why not try your luck on the track and earn some racing certificates? Trust me, they can be mighty useful. Greetings. Name's Jackie Weeks, and I'm the Empresario who runs all the high-speed races in Wellspring. And I do mean all. If you're interested in testing your skill, you can go talk to my business associate over there, Slim. He can get you all set up to race. And do come back if you feel the need for some speed. Greetings, stranger. <laughs> you look like a racer to me. Hey, you ready to try and win some racing certificates? Welcome, friend. Name's Carl, but seems like everyone calls me Slim. <laughs> Funny, huh? All right, the deal is, if you want to race, you talk to me. Now, just take a look at all the events we have here, find something you like, and assuming you meet the requirements, then you're in. All the prizes aren't racing certificates, you know. Good to get new vehicle upgrades at Rusty's. <laughs> well, everyone needs those. Check out what races are available. Drive safe. 